Hello, Nets. Welcome once again to Gina High School Hour on Joy Learning TV channel. Today, I am your facilitator for ICT, Isaac Ohine Abankwa. Today, we're going to talk about managing files. For the past three weeks, we have been dealing with the graphic user interface, where we dealt with where we dealt with uh, the desktop of a computer, we said the desktop of a computer is the first screen you see or you meet after code booting your computer. Well, we also looked at features of the desktop of a computer. We made mention of the icons, we made mention of the touch bar, we made mention of the quick access to bars and all those things and today we are going to focus on the icons and specifically we are going to talk about files how to manage them now remember that when files are created through programs like microsoft word and any other program because we said files last week we said files can be created through what Microsoft Word or any other program and a file is determined by the program which is created or which is used in creating it well at the end of today's lesson we should be able to rename a file we should be able to also remove a file delete a file restore a file from the recycle bin and also empty the recycle bin as simple as that rename a file remove a file delete a file restore a file from the recycle bin and also empty the recycle bin okay so the first question is what is a file I have already defined a file to be what a created document eh, which is saved on the computer. And I also said that what a file can only be opened by the document, oh sorry, the program which is used in opening it. A file can only be opened by what the program which is used in opening it. Okay, so that means that we cannot use um, a web application to open a, a presentation um, file. That means you cannot use Microsoft Word to open Microsoft um, PowerPoint. They are two different programs altogether. Okay. Now, when we talk about managing a file, we are talking about how we name and remove all files and all those things but the question is why do we rename a file why is it necessary to rename a file we are going to do a little bit practical we're going to be practical today so what i want you to do now is get your pens and your paper and write the steps down if you don't have a computer by you just write the steps down hey if i can get one from mommy or daddy or if you have your personal one why don't you grab it let's practice remember practice makes perfect so why do we rename a file now let's say i have created a file and named it coffee mensa now anyone who comes to my computer and, ha and sees that file what does it say about the file it's just a name and we don't know what actually is in the file so to be more specific, I can say biography of Kofi Mensa. Then anyone who sees my file can say that no, this is what the biography of what Kofi Mensa. By the way, I'm not Kofi Mensa. <laughs> so as I was saying, one of the reasons what to be specific with what the content. Make sure that the content and the name of the file are what the same or they match. Renaming a file is necessary when you have also edited a document. Now, after editing a document, and you think the name of the document is not matching the, its content, then you should also want to rename it. 
Remember, always when you are choosing a name for a file, it should be a name that will match its content so that you don't mistake it for any other thing. Yes. And also, when a file is already created or bears the same name, one of it is supposed to be what? Renamed. Now, this over here, I'm talking about when they are saved in two different locations. Fortunately, when they are all saved in the same location, there will be a prompter that will tell you to what? To change the name or to replace the file. Do you want to replace that file? Then if you don't want, then you have to rename the file. So these are some of the few reasons why a file is what renamed. Now let's look at the process that we go through in renaming a file. Now, the first thing you should also know when you are coming to rename a file is the location.